Yeah, come here in the middle. In the middle. You want to kiss me again? Mm -hmm. <laughs> there you go. Hello from the Music Interview Corner, guys. What's up, guys? We're back with Santa Cruz in Hollywood at the legendary Viper Room. Hell Hi, Archie. yeah. Hey, what's up, baby? How you doing? Hi, good, good. Nice <laughs> to see you again. Nice to see you, too. It's been a while. Yes, yes. Yeah. How is it for you to be back? It's awesome. We get to play the Viper Room. It's, <laughs> you know, it's legendary. It's great. Dream it's come a, true. Yes. It is a dream come true. And great we have stuff. a brand new lineup. Do you want to introduce the most important part of your new lineup? I do. Yeah, the, most the, the dude. Important. <laughs> the yeah. most important dude in the fucking band is right here. Yes. He's called Hero. Uh, I, I was talk, thinking that you're talking about it yourself. But yeah, hey, I'm Hero. Nice to meet you guys. And I got Matthias over here. Yeah. Drummer. Come here. <laughs> you want to come? Come here, baby. Oh, drummers are always yeah. so shy. Hi. What's up? Hi. Welcome. How are you doing? Hey. hey. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what? Oh no, he's running away again. Finnish guys are always so shy. Yeah. He's actually so French. French, really? Yeah. But you look Finnish. He does. Oh. He's he hangs out with a lot of Finnish That's people. Yeah. Oh yes. Yeah. An insult? No. Uh, by the way, it is so awkward to speak English here, but we decided to do it in English, but I thought we can use Finnish swear words whenever we feel like it. Vittu perkele saatana. Vittu et kuuma. Vai vittu perhana. Vittu. Jumalauta. That's right. That's so good. talking about. Yes. So how did you guys meet? Uh, we met actually in a elementary, elementary school. school. Yeah. Really? Yeah, we were in the same grade since uh, the first grade. And... Uh, we actually formed a band. I think it was a four, around fourth grade or yeah. fifth grade, oh. and uh, we just formed a band. What was the name of the band? Santa Cruz. <laughs> really? No. But you were in Santa Cruz Dingo. before. <laughs> Dingo. Well, I know Dingo was. Uh, yeah, yeah, wow. Okay. Hanoi Rocks or yeah, Dingo? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Rocks. We started that. Yeah, and um, we started out as Hanoi Rocks. Yeah. You might have heard about us. Yes, and, and we then changed the name to Santa. Fuck yeah, you, because Santa Cruz is so much better. I'm sorry, guys. I know, I know. Yeah, right in the middle of two rockers. Yes, I like mm. to be between long-haired Finnish guys. Oh, you do? That's, uh, yeah, that's the purpose of my life, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> well, welcome to heaven. Oh yeah, it is. It feels pretty much like heaven. Awesome. So you met each other before Santa Cruz was formed? Uh, yeah, we we went to the same elementary school and. I don't know. Archie actually started to listen like all those eighties stuff, like mm -hmm. Matthew Crew, Guns N' Roses, okay. and he pulled me into it, and that's why we actually built this band. We started this band. That's right. Yeah. But you were then not in the lineup of Santa Cruz when we spoke the last time. I was in the first lineup, but then I started my own band. Archie went to other school. So how does it feel for you to to be back in Santa Cruz? Fucking awesome. Feels like coming home. Cool. Yeah. And how did you find the other two guys? On YouTube. Really? Yeah. <laughs> wow, that's how you do it now. That's the millennial way of doing find, it. You know, find chicks on the Instagram and you find band members on YouTube. YouTube wow. musicians. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe we should invite some to dance in the background for this interview. Next time I will oh, have next some. Next time, for sure. <laughs> it's doing good. It's already great, right? It's already fucking classic. Just, I don't know if we can still top this when we go on with the interview, but... Uh, I, 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 I doubt it. <laughs> Sunset so. Street. Yay! Yeah. Aji wants to do something special for us. There you go. Oh, but it was not high enough. You have to go closer to the wall because now right, it was like out this? of frame. Yes. Whoa. It's Finnish okay. ass. <laughs> Finnish bootay. <laughs> you like that? Oh, we're still yeah. on. <laughs> we're still on. Oh, then we are all on, on frame. Hello. It should be on frame. Yes. <laughs> so guys, the Viper Room is one of the most legendary concert venues in the world. How does it feel for you guys to play there tonight? It feels pretty fucking sick, to be honest. Especially having written a song called River Phoenix. Yes, you I know. wanted to talk to you about that because... Which we're not going to play tonight. Oh, no, that was my question because <laughs> for everyone who doesn't know, River Phoenix died outside the Viper Room in 1993 and you wrote this song and so you're not going to play it tonight. No, fuck Why? no. Dude, I want to respect River's memory. Mm -hmm. I don't want to like fucking, you know, piss on his grave. You know what I'm saying? That's we got, very nice of you. Yeah, thank you, baby. That's Thanks. how you are. Finnish guys are always so nice, you know. Exactly, we are. Are you filming me now? Yeah, yeah. You're vlogging. You have to come a little bit closer to us. I don't want to. Don't you outside. think I'm crazy? This is don't you think yes. I care? What was the inspiration for the song River Phoenix? The Viper Room. Really? Yeah. <laughs> wow, now you're playing here tonight. Fuck yeah. You're playing in the middle of your inspiration now. I know. Yeah. And on your new album, like your last album, first we talk about the last album, which was called That Blood Rising. <laughs> yeah. You have a song, Get Me Out of California. Dude, this is fucking passive smoking, dude. Yeah, say no to drugs here. Say no to Vito. nicotine. Say fuck yeah to cigarettes. Vito. Tell this motherfucker to put the cigarette out. Dude. <laughs>
Vittu, miksi, miksi? Koska se on hyvä. Yeah, so you got the song Get Me Out of California. What is the story behind that song? Uh, I was actually in Italy. I wrote the verse in Italy. And we had a guitar player at the time. He wrote the chorus in California. Wah, 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 wah. He wrote the chorus in California, you wrote the song in Italy. Yes. Make good friends. Okay. So we make friends. Yeah. Exactly. Making enemies is good. Making enemies is good. Yeah. And you also had the idea on your last album on Bad Blood Rising to cover a One Direction song, Drag Me Down. Who had this idea? It was me, baby. It was me. Let's talk about the next album. I hate that fucking yes, album. Really? <laughs> yeah. Because yeah, your new album is going to come out October, October 18th, right? Yeah. Yes. And it's called Catharsis. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Fuck yeah. How did you experience the recording process with the new lineup? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Actually. You were not there. No, I wasn't there. I was Why? Me too. He, he did the only work. I was the only one in the studio. You were on, so you recorded it alone, so it's a solo album. You could say that. Yeah, it's kind of you could say, really? you know, Lenny Kravitz does it, Prince does it. I figured, where the hell Archie Cruz shouldn't do it. <laughs> Fuck yeah. So re you recorded it alone and then you guys made it like f for the tour, like as a, yeah. you turned the solo album into a Santa Cruz tour thing. Yeah, we rehearsed it. Uh... The thing was, <laughs> the original fucking band like disbanded in the middle of tour. I know, I was so sad when I heard that. I'm glad that you're back. Yeah, baby. Uh, I'm glad too. So, immediately I decided that I wanted to make another record and tour after with, uh, you know, if not the same guys, different guys. So I just, you know, I focused myself on the record. I went, I went to Las Vegas for three months and I was working with a producer called Kane Cherko. Oh. And I was co-writing the songs with him. I was experimenting with the sound and I wanted to create, create something new because I felt for the longest time, I felt that the old Santa Cruz sound had reached its peak a long time ago. So there was really nowhere to go with, it, with that. We did the album. I decided it, I decided to call it Catharsis because of the uh, effect mm -hmm. it had on my, you know me. It's like it's cleaning. Are you detox now in a way? I oh. kinda yeah. I feel like it. Cool. At least when it comes out. And uh, yeah, and uh, I'm just I'm, I'm looking forward to the tour. I'm looking forward to doing the next album because mm -hmm. I feel like this is only like set in the future up. Mm -hmm. cool. If you know what I'm saying? Like yes. You know? I'm excited. It's like kind of like the first album of the new era. Cool. And the next one is going to be even better. Yeah. Hi, this is Joe, the new guitarist, right? Hi, Joe. <laughs> Thanks, man. Don't Thanks do don't do drugs. No, Thank you, never. Joe. Thank you, Joe. Thanks for backing me up, okay. dog. Stay in school. And how is it for you to be the only English-speaking guy in this Finnish band? Well, sometimes I feel like an alien from outer space, mm -hmm. but I feel like that anyways around people who speak English, <laughs> so I fit right in. <laughs> Fuck yeah. How did you end up in Santa Cruz? How did you meet these guys here? Um, I think I met Archie. We met the Rainbow. Yeah, at the Down Rainbow. The street. My favorite place, and you know it sounds so much cooler when you say it in Finnish. Satankari Bari. Satankari Bari. Yes, Rainbow Bar. Yes. Yeah. But yeah, how did you meet? What, what happened in the uh, Rainbow? We have, a, we have a mutual friend who introduced us a couple of years ago. Who's right there, yeah. actually. The French guy who was, who, was, who was on camera like a moment ago. I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I don't either, but the only pictures. reason, yeah, the, those photos, that's the only reason I know that that happened. <laughs> oh, wow. I saw the people, I was like, did that actually happen? <laughs> so, okay, you don't remember anything, you just were in the band at the end of the night? No, no, this, this is years ago. <laughs> and then maybe a couple weeks ago, Archie called me and needed someone to come play. He actually. I remember that night. The only thing I remember about that night was Joe, Joe talking to me and saying that if I ever needed a guitar player, I should link him up. Mm -hmm. Call me. Yeah. So uh, the time came. Here I needed one. Here we are. <laughs> Playing the, play the yeah. Viper Room. And what did you think yeah. about Santa Cruz before you became a band member? Thought they were great. Cool. Great music. Great riffs. Sexy guys. Sexy guys. Of course, Fucking yes, of abs. Perfect abs. Perfect abs. Of nice course. fucking biceps. They don't I swear. Don't <laughs> they don't <laughs> smoke. I listened to your new single, oh, yeah? Into the Wall. Uh -huh. Yes. How did you come up with the idea for that? Uh, it's, I was actually listening to a lot of Thursday Nights to Mars, which I think comes through on the track. You, mm -hmm. you can tell. So I wanted to do a pop song with like a DLA guitar. Mm -hmm. 
And a positive song, a happy song about like going forward in life, not just a rock song about, yeah, let's fucking do fucking drugs and you know. Mm -hmm. It's just like a <laughs> song about just going into the war, not necessarily going into the war with guns and shit, mm -hmm. but into the war like fighting the haters and everybody who's like down in you. That's like my personal war to show them all that we're kicking ass. Great, I love the song. Fucking kicking, quitting. <laughs> Yeah. No, I love this song. And how does it feel for you to publish your new album during your US tour? It feels amazing. Hey, what's up, dude? Hey! Yeah, Adi has so many friends here. That's amazing. Everybody's my friend. <laughs> <laughs> the song's a strip, dog. It feels very good. It feels, uh, it feels like it's meant to be, you know? We're out here on tour. And the reason we did the uh, album here in America was because we wanted to reach American crowd with the new sound. And not just stay in Europe and Scandinavia and, you know, do the same shit that every band out there does. Yeah, and that's why we're doing it in English today, the interview, for you guys, for you American guys out there. The US of United States of America, dog. <laughs> that's what we're doing out here. Peace. Is there something you have never told in an interview and you might want to tell me today? I have a vagina. Wow, thank you guys. Did you know that? I don't think anybody knows that, but I really do. But now they do. Yeah, well how, well, how do you feel about that? I interesting, I'm very open, you know. Oh, yeah? yeah? Would you like to try my badge? <laughs> <laughs> Is there anything else you want to say to your fans? I don't actually have a vagina. <laughs> And we, we love all the fans, to all of you supporters out there. See you on the road, you guys rule. Cannot wait to fucking kick some ass out on the road. Tonight at the Viper Room. Yay! You know. See some titties. <laughs> <laughs> Have some fun. Yeah. Peace. Thank you so much, Aji, and goodbye from the music interview corner. Thank oh. you. Thank you so much. You're